Utumuti yoga shate nji. Abe no mdini. Nabantwana. Hai angboni. Hi guys, my name is Crazy Njofu and welcome back to my channel. Someone posted this and said, I remote your relationships this year. It purchased this bank. I would show leg too. And I just couldn't agree more. I mean, what is going on? Guys, I tried to speak positivity into 2018. You remember? On my first video, 2018 is the year of positivity and prosperity. But no, no, no prosperity in any realm or aspect. Physically, I'm mad far from my body goals. Academically, yay, there's actually something I have to tell you at the end of this video about that. So please watch this video until the end. And romantically, that's what this video is about. I mean, where's the romance? Where's the love? Why women in I'm saying everyone I know who went into 2018 in a relationship is no longer in a relationship. Oh, would you look at that? Breakups. Breakups everywhere. And the funny thing is, all of these breakups are usually over something trivial. I'm gonna one bigger chola another girl first semester. Everything was good. Perfect. And then June Vac came. Baby girls started complaining at the Sang Nagi, we hardly ever chat. You don't text me enough. And my friend would call her three or four times a day, every day. But because he didn't text her on WhatsApp, I know Gunji. Baby girl say that I can't do this anymore. I feel like you're not that into me. You claim to be crazy about me, but you don't even. You don't even. Askis, askis. I know Gunji. What's it? It's over. Over that. Over. Unga text go WhatsApp. This other female friend of mine broke up with her boyfriend because her friend told her that she saw the boyfriend in the club talking to a female friend that they hate. Yeah, that's the reason they broke up. Imagine! I mean, you break up with me because your friend says she saw me in the club. No pictures, no videos, no texts, no form of evidence that it was actually me. She saw me talking to a girl that y'all hate. And then because of that, you can't do this anymore. What is going on? Like you break up over that and back to Allah, love you understand? You shouldn't be breaking up over such petty things at this age. I mean, we're all over 21, which is close to 25, which is like almost 30. So why are we still breaking up over some high school-ish? Now I've answered my question. Generation yet, is No, but I think the problem is we aren't patient enough with each other. Yeah, but you need to understand that you've never been in a relationship with me. If I prefer going out every weekend and you prefer staying indoors, okay, let's let's find a way around that. We can go out sometimes and then we can stay in sometimes. I mean, if you prefer texting on WhatsApp and I prefer making phone calls, then okay, let's meet each other halfway. We can chat sometimes, we can call sometimes. But I'm just trying to say there are ways to work things out. Relationships won't last really if at the first sign of something that you don't like, you decide, I, I, I mean, I know, I can't. I'm not, no, I didn't sign up for this. Nope. I think I made a good point, Nangati. You've never been in a relationship with Lomundu. Like it's, if y'all, it's the first time you guys are dating. You need to make time to understand what Lomundu wants, what Lomundu feels, what Lomundu expects from you. I wanna, don't get me wrong. I mean, I'm not saying you must settle for something that you know you don't want but go into a relationship knowing what's okay this person I, I, I'm gonna have to understand this person I'm gonna have to figure this person out different I'm not gonna compare this person to my ex I'm not gonna expect him to talk to me or her to talk to me the same way my ex did as often as my ex did and you understand I think if you take my advice and just be more patient. That's that's basically what I'm saying. Be more patient with each other. That's why I'm a relationship in 2018 didn't last because people are too flimsy. Nya papa, nya papa, nya hoots, nits, 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 nits. Sit down and understand. Go into the relationship. Osho in your mind, oh, it's okay. As in, I want to make this work. I like this person. This person's nice. You've spent time with them and you feel like, yeah, let me figure this person out. Let me work. Let's make things work. If you take my advice, we'll definitely see an improvement in my relationships. But that's for 2019. It's too late now. Since big days in Duana. I saw a post earlier this week that read, if you're not in a relationship at 11.59 p.m. on the 31st of July, 
then sale so yega. Because that's it's 1 August, 12 a.m. Big days, boy. Woo! Lapa saba begging. Sazo bam nan. Sazo bam nan. But yeah, no, 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 I digress. A point is relationships in 2018 are cancelled. They've all been trash. And everybody on my Instagram agreed. I posted this there and everyone was like, yeah. Yeah, everyone replied to their story like, mm 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 quiz. Relationships this year have been utter. Yes, I asked you guys if there's anything you want me to mention in this video. The general response was people need to stop being trash, people need to stop leading people on, people need to stop cheating, people need to stop lying, people need to stop mistreating the people that they claim to love. I wonder if it wasn't for all of this, then maybe relationships in 2018 would have turned out better, young tall. Guys, I talk about 2018 as if so pelil, as if it's now like December. No, so pelil is too late for relationships. Sissy with big days, boy, I'm telling you, son, no. One person said I must talk about how I've been dribbled before or how I dribbled a girl before. Whoa, hectic. But yes, that's gonna come up later on my channel as a story time. You don't wanna miss that, so press the subscribe button right now. Also, follow me on Instagram to keep up with me at QuizzyXO. And now we're at the end of the video and I have something to tell you. I didn't wanna make this video too long. I don't like to ramble on for too long. But yeah, the announcement is there's been an unforeseen and rather unpleasant development with my academics. I am leaving NMU in about 10 days. I'm gonna be based in Joburg now. This was really unforeseen and it absolutely wasn't by choice. I'm more sad about it than anything else, but I have faith in God's plan. But anyway, that's all I can say for now about that. Just keep subscribed to my channel and you'll keep up to date with me and whatever's happening in my life. I'll still be posting videos, trust me. But yes, comment down below and tell me what you think about relationships in 2018 or relationships in general. Anything that you'd like to share with me, just feel free to comment down below. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys again next Sunday. Bye-bye. Let it go.